We have beautiful water, beautiful bays, beautiful beaches, just one beautiful place to live. I've seen some big estuaries in my life, but this one takes the cake. The Fitzroy River Delta is a mighty system. When I'm on the water, I just feel I could turn my clock back three or four hundred years or three or four thousand years because there hasn't been that much change here yet, but we've got to be careful. The Fitzroy Delta is at the mouth of the Fitzroy River and it's the largest river system that feeds into the southern Great Barrier Reef. It's a vast and interconnected estuarine system. The complicated network of all of the vegetation and species that live in the area is critical to the overall health of the delta, the bay and the reef. If they were ever to, to look at coal facilities there, they, they would be required to dredge that area. In 2012, there were three massive port projects planned for this area. They would have destroyed the shoreline and dredged and dumped in the Great Barrier Reef World Heritage Area. Although these projects have been abandoned, there's still nothing to legally stop it from happening again. When we start changing these sorts of things, we can fundamentally alter these things in ways that we never really anticipated. There are unique species in the Fitzroy Delta, like the snubfin dolphin, the flatback turtle, and the Capricorn yellow chat. Several times a year, we'll find whales in the bay. We, as the trustees of this area, need to make sure that we value it and do everything we can to protect it.